Hello, how you doing? Hi, how are you? All right, so first of all, we're here at the Environmental Movie uh, Media Awards. Sorry, I was going to think of the VMAs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But my question is, you know, 18 and under, the kids coming up, what is like one tip that you've learned that you could pass on to them that they could actually start making happen right now? 18 and under. Yeah, because it's, it's really the next generation. Some of the kids aren't about the green yet, so we're trying to get them on the green. That's, yeah, that's interesting. Okay, here's really simple. Okay, for example, one day I watched that documentary, Food, Inc. Yeah, yeah. And then the, uh, I saw an Oprah, and I was sitting with my sister. We're catching up on our Oprahs. And the guy who, who uh, created that film was on her show and revealed uh, the restaurant Chipotle. So for kids that are 18 and under, if you want to go get a burrito, chicken burrito, and you want it to be really awesome, really tasty, and really healthy, you should go to Chipotle because they raise all of their own chickens, farm-raised, no pesticides. The cycle of life is protected, and it's the best <laughs> burrito. It's good. It just eclipses all of the other ones. So that's something you can do is choose better food. It does catch up with you. I know you, I mean, I do love me some Taco Bell, okay? But those kind of things are actually something that there are so many more resources, and it doesn't have to taste like you're eating a uh, granola or a piece of cardboard. You know, those sort of things are actually out there, responsible food, and it's actually, you feel better, it, it tastes better, and you're actually being more responsible. Yeah. And, you know, there, there are a lot of cool hybrid cars that are be coming out that, you know, it, once you start paying your gas bill, once you start filling up that clunker that your parents <laughs> gave you, you might want to rethink yeah. a, a hybrid, and you start that early. Yeah. And now, you know, sadly, your very successful show, it's been on forever, Cold Case, is no longer. Um, do you miss it? I mean, we, we've we been following your character forever, you and your mom's relationship, and, I mean, your dad's relationship and everything. How, how has it been hard? It's like your baby, right? Or? Well, you know, it, we did seven years. It was exactly what the... Uh, the contract said on the, and we were all fine with where it was because it was it was just like the right. We went out exactly the way that we wanted to go. We're really close, the cast and the crew. That's really the only thing that I that I miss. Uh, I was wasn't really uh, sure that I wanted to continue after that because I mean, we did like 160 of them. So, um, but two weeks after um, the cold case ended, I got a beautiful script for a movie called Moneyball, okay. starring Brad Pitt and Philip Seymour Hoffman, and directed by Bennett Miller and and Jonah Hill's in it. And it's uh, a baseball movie, right? Yeah, it's a baseball movie. It's, but it's, it's really just a great film about um, anybody that's ever had a dream and thought that it was impossible. When you have a bunch of bad news bears that put together and they actually work out. You know, anybody that's ever tried to accomplish something that seemed impossible. So it's really so much more than baseball. So I, I, uh, I wouldn't have had the opportunity to do that if the show continued. And all of my cast is off doing other things, yeah. and uh, the crew is working on the same stage on other shows. So that, is, there's a time for things. And yeah. uh, you is know. that your next focus? You want to start? You know, keep piling out film. I really had such a great time. We just fin finished shooting. I had a great time doing the movie, and I'm also producing a lot of television shows. I just sold one t uh, to ABC okay. a few weeks ago. It's, I'm going to do a co-production with Eva Longoria. It's a nighttime soap. So I'm um, having a lot of success in the television production world. I'll take a break from TV myself or, uh, and really uh, focus on the pace of movies and the material that is yeah. out there for right. right now. Before you go, can you tell us where, when the movie might be airing or coming out? You know. It's going to open September next year. September next year. Yeah. September next year, Social apparently. Social network slot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. So we'll see you next year with Brad Pitt. Sounds good. All right, thank you. <laughs>